Hey there Titans, welcome to Form Titan Basics. In this video I will show you how to integrate your Salesforce multi-pick list with the Form Titan checkbox element while you set up your checkbox element manually. So let's add in our checkbox. So we have automatically first choice, second choice, third choice and other. Let's say we don't want the other and obviously you can take off or add anything else. We're going to add fourth. And how to sync this dynamically with Salesforce, you already know. You click here and you set it up. We have videos about that. But let's say you don't want to sync it dynamically from Salesforce, because let's say you just want some of the options of the multi pick list that you got in Salesforce that applies for a regular pick list as well. And you want to sync this with Salesforce. So let's take a look at our pick list field. So we have just a simple multi pick list field that contains the days of the week. And one thing to pay attention to that you got to grab, you got to know the API name of your pick list values. So we are at the account, uh, at our custom field, uh, field information. And we want to. Uh, Let's say that the first choice will be Sunday, second, Monday, third, Tuesday, and fourth, Wednesday. And we want this whenever someone selects first, second, and third, or anything else that it will correlate with our days of the week multiple pick list. Let's see how we can get this done. So we're going to head over to Advanced, click on the Advanced Values. Then the only thing you got to do is put in the value your pick list value API name. So we're gonna, we did Monday, so Tuesday, and that one will be Wednesday. You can obviously change your label to match your pick list value API name. In this instance, I'm showing you the power of Form Titan where you can give it a different label and still push it to Salesforce is something else. So let's change to Monday. Second choice, we'll apply that. Save our form. Let's set up our push. So Salesforce integration, push to Salesforce. We're gonna add an account object. It's just a simple create, no conditions. We're gonna map our account name to the account name and our multi -pick list custom field to our checkbox and we're going to map it to the checkbox value. Apply and finish, save our form. Let's publish it. And give it checkbox. And we're going to select first, third, and fourth. So we're supposed to get it in Salesforce Sunday Tuesday and Wednesday. Let's submit our form. Head over to our integration logs and we have an account created. Let's take a look. So you can see the name is manual checkbox and like I said before we got the Sunday, Tuesday and Wednesday. And this is how it's done.